Okay, so this is why y'all should be using silicone cups to mix all your resin in, because look at this. Look how freaking easy that is. See, you just pull it right out and off. This is kind of sticky because this is like the mixing cup, but yeah. And then I just kind of roll it like this to loosen the pieces inside. And then I wipe it out with rubbing alcohol, which is, uh, let's see, oh, uh, ee, ooh, ee. there we go. Anyways, wipe it out with rubbing alcohol. And I wear gloves to do this because sometimes the resin is still a little sticky, but then look at this. It's perfectly clean. <laughs> and I'll show you the difference. Like this is a plastic cup I also use. Look at that, okay? I, on a resin cup, would have been able to just pull this stuff off. But look, like, yeah, there's no point. It is welded to that, it's not coming off. So highly recommend getting yourself some of these. Unfortunately, they don't come in very small sizes, but if you look, some of these, you can kind of see it still a little bit, but I mark the smallest measurements and I use those. So five and 10 uh, milliliters, like that's what that is right there. So that's the smallest it goes down to. Highly recommend silicone cups though.